my name is Victoria Rose. Not Victoria X-Ray, but it's Victoria Rose. This is, uh, this is one of my most scary to me videos. If you've been following along my journey of life, I've been changing and growing. Obviously, I tried to color my hair a different color, but we're still working on that. But not only did I want to color my hair a different color, lately, for the past while now, I've just been like thinking about cutting my dreadlocks. There are a lot of reasons for this, and I want to go over those reasons before I cut them off right now in front of you. Since I've been on YouTube, I've had dreadlocks, and, and I've had longer dreadlocks. Like, I've never had short hair, like, what do I feel like cutting it right now? I think every five years, you're a whole different person. Not that I'm completely different, but I want different things now, which is really good for me because I've struggled with certain things. I've been very looks, kind of like, I have like obsessive tendencies in my mind. I don't want to say that I'm obsessed with my looks because that's not what I'm trying to say. I don't want looks to define me. I don't want that to be my worth. I've been searching for a long time for my place in the world. I haven't really found my place exactly yet. Still working on that. I'm figuring out a little bit more. I know that I am more than my looks. I'm more than my hair, my tattoos. I don't need to do any of this kind of stuff to, to be any more worth anything. And uh, after having more solid relationships in my life, which I never really had before, I've realized that I don't need to be this <laughs> person, this obnoxious person to get affection and, and uh, affirmation and cared about, you know? I, I'm rambling on so much right now. I don't know where this video is going. The main reason that I look the way that I do is because I really like it and it expresses me. But I don't want it to go to the point where it's like, I don't feel worthy because I'm not different enough. You know, I don't, I don't care about that. Another thing is that dreadlocks are heavy. They're heavy and it's been getting really annoying. My dreadlocks, um, my hair is very fine. So they've, the way that they've formed is that uh, there's a lot of hair in this. This is years worth of hair. This is all my real hair, by the way. This is like cutting off a piece of me, which is why I'm rambling so much because this is a big deal and I'm, I'm kind of terrified. They're heavy. There's a lot of hair in here. There's a lot of life experience in these dreadlocks. They're actually weighty and they're heavy in the sense of there's a lot of things I want to just cut out and just start over with. Also, if I want to go back to having long hair, which I might when I'm in California, I might hit up my friend Flower to put extensions in for me. I feel like this is the best decision for me right now and I'm going to do it now. Let's begin, okay? <laughs> Let's stop rambling and cut away the the past Victoria and start fresh and anew. So I don't really know how to do this. It's one thing cutting like normal hair, but it's another thing cutting off like dreads. Maybe I should sell some of my dreadlocks. Would you guys buy them? Leave a comment if you would buy a dread and how much I should charge for them so I can save up some money for food and stuff. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so scared. I'm just gonna, I don't know how long I want them to be. I'm just gonna start right here for now. Oh, maybe that's too short. I'm scared. This is terrifying. I'm cutting off literal pieces of myself. Wow, that's way too short. All right. I'm getting scared. How's this gonna look? Okay, that just got shorter. This is too short. Okay, I'm freaking out. I'm just gonna like stop the video for a second. Recompose myself. Okay, I recomposed myself a little bit. Sorry about that. I was just cutting them a bit short. This is freaking out, but it's okay. <sighs> We're just gonna keep going with it. I'm probably gonna like brush them out, to, like give me some more length. I'm, I'm still very undecided how I feel about this. I don't, I don't, I think I'm kind of in shock. I don't think I know how to feel at this moment, at this moment right now. I have so much buildup in these dreadlocks. It's good that I'm getting rid of them because there's a lot of buildup. It's okay, this is good, this is good guys, this is good. I just have no idea what this is gonna look like in the back, <laughs> so.
already feel it getting lighter. Just weird. You know, no one tells you how life is going to be or what you're supposed to do, how you're supposed to do it. I mean, I guess it's kind of cool. You get to choose your own adventure, but sometimes it gets really confusing and it would just sometimes be nice just to not have to make all these decisions and just be, you know, these are the long ones. That's a long one. And I think I'm cutting too short again. So I'm going to go back to the front here because I want to make sure that this is, is even. I feel like a classy lady now. All right, I'm gonna finish up this side right here. I'll show you what the back looks like. I don't even know what the back looks like. I still got some long ones going on, but my head's still, it's still light, movable. We're done. I still have this long one back here. I don't know. I just wanted to show you the, the, the length comparison. I really don't know what this looks like in the back. I need to check. Wow, that's crazy. I look like a, a Sesame Street character. <laughs> Last one. They're cut. It's done. Okay, so that was me cutting off my dreadlocks. I'll show you the aftermath here. I feel free. I feel good. Like, I don't feel like this is a mistake. And my hair, my head feels so much lighter. Here is right here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all this. It smells good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I, it was, I really enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you're new here. Stay extraterrestrial. I have nothing else to say. Stay tuned for the next vlog. Thank you for being here. And if you've been here since the beginning, Thank you, and I hope that I make you proud. You can, you can leave into my dreadlocks.